What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Winnipeg Checklist, where we go to local businesses and try their product or service to drive some traffic, grow awareness, and support a local business like ourselves. Today, we're at Joy Coffee Bar, which is a local coffee shop, breakfast place, and a lunch place. And we're gonna to talk to Alex, who's the general manager and the owner, and ask him all about it. Let's check it out. All right, Alex, so thanks for having us, appreciate it. So tell me more about this place. Uh, we located in Chazwood area from 2018 and we provide uh, coffee and food. It's mean Israeli and European breakfast, brunch, lunch. One of the famous dishes is a hummus, falafel and the shakshuka. So we try to create all these guys under one roof, good coffee and comfort food. Very nice. Okay, okay. That's awesome. So what's the most popular dish here? The most popular dish is uh, Jeff's Trio. It's hummus, red shakshuka and the falafel. The second one is Tunisian sandwich. And the third one, it's a Norwegian waffle. Two waffles, smoked salmon and sunny side of eggs. Very nice. Okay, so lunchtime, really hungry. What are we getting? With Big Lab, we're going to make you guys the Jeff's Trio and the Tunisian sandwich. All right, and then two coffees. What, what, what are we doing? Only cappuccinos, guys. You deserve it. Awesome. Thank you very much. You. Wow, that looks beautiful. Oh, the first sip of coffee feeling, you know what I'm talking about? You can always taste when coffee is made with passion versus just like made out of a pot, you know? Like one of those like Black & Decker machines at home that you have, like that's just like a coffee out of a pot, you know? But like when it's made with passion, you can like taste it. Also, I love the coziness and the design of this place. Like. Look at the, the freaking baskets that are on the wall in the, like the little reception area or whatever that are turned 90 degree to make them to shelves. Like that's genius. Or like these little shelves that they made out of like wood panels. So there's wood paneling everywhere. And then they took one wood panel, turned it 90 degree to make it a shelf. Like that is so cool. And then through it, you can see like a coffee bag behind it. Like genius. Like definitely a cute date place. Nice breakfast place, nice coffee, early morning coffee to have a fantastic day after this. Like certainly recommend before I even try the food. And the food, like Austin even said, that this might be the best coffee you've ever tried, so. Oh, it is, absolutely. Yeah, and I would agree. Like, it's really good. Nice. Oh, wow. Look at that presentation. Wow. No, that looks delicious. Know. So we have the Jeff's Trio. It's a hummus, traditional red shakshuka, and the falafels. And here we have Norwegian waffle. It's a waffle, red onions, black olives, sunny set up eggs. And this one is a Tunisian sandwich. Came with tuna salad, boiled potato, egg, eggplant, and preserved lemon. I'm telling you, so much passion went into this place. You can just tell. So good. So good. Like I've said before in other episodes, the food's not gonna eat itself, so I'm just gonna keep going here. Like, honestly, 10 out of 10. All right, so we got a lemonade, mint, slushy as well. Let's try this out as well. Oh, that's refreshing, hey? Eh? Alex, that was absolutely delicious. Thank you for everything, much appreciated. So tell me, what's the best place people can find out more about this place? Instagram, Facebook, and of course, just stop by here for a small coffee, small snack, and it will be nice to meet. Awesome, awesome. Thanks so much. Thank you guys. Much appreciated. Thank you very much. Well, if you guys are looking for a cozy place, lots of good food, some good coffee, stop by jo Joey Coffee Bar uh, on Robland here. And if you guys have a recommendation for a future place we should check out, please let us know in the comments below or send us a DM. And we'll see you in the next one.